Dear students, today we start exercise 15.1, that is probability unit. So, 15.1, before solving the exercise, first we have to know some properties of probability. We know the properties of probability, I want to write here, number one, probability of an event is always lies between 0 and 1. The answer always lies between 0 and 1 and greater than 0 and less than or equal. Greater than or equal to 0, less than or equal to 1. So, number 2, another property is probability E plus probability not E equal to 1. So, sometimes we write this in this way, probability E, probability E bar equal to 1. This is E and this one E bar. This result is 1. And also we know probability of impossible event. Impossible event equal to 0. This number 3. And number 4 Number four, probability. Uh, number four, probability of certain or sure event, certain or sure event. This equal to one. So these are the prob uh, properties of probabilities. Uh, we have to know these properties and sometimes in your exam, this will ask in short question, fill in the blanks. So, first condition is probability of an event always lies between 0 and 1 and probability of E, probability of not E equal to 1. This symbol you can write probability of E, probability of E bar equal to 1. And probability of impossible event 0, probability of certain event equal to 1. These are the properties. Now, we consider the exercise 15.1. Number 1 given, complete the following statements. Some statements are given, we want to complete this. Probability of an event E plus probability of event not E equal to this one. Probability of event E, probability of event not E equal to 1. So, answer is 1. Number 1, probability of E plus probability of not E equal to answer 1. Number 2 given, the probability of an event that cannot happen such is this, such an event is called this. The probability of event that cannot happen means this is answer 0. This answer 0. And such an event is called impossible event. This one, impossible event. So, this is impossible. Probability of impossible event is 0. So, we call impossible event. Impossible event. So, this is number 2. Number 3 we consider. In number 3, the probability of an event that is certain to happen, that means sure event, is 1. Such an event is called sure or certain event. So, this result is 1 and this is called uh, sure or certain event. Sure or certain event. Sure or certain event. And number 4, the sum of the probabilities of all the elementary events of an experiment is always 1. So, this is answer 1. Sum of the probabilities is always 1. Number 5. 
the probability of an event is greater than or equal to this and less than or equal to this. This one. Probability of an event greater than or equal to 0 and less than or equal to 1. So, this is 0 and 1. So, these are the answer of the given problem. Problem number 4. The problem 4 given which of the following cannot be the probability of an event? So, some results given A given 2 by 3, B given minus 1.5, and C given 15%, D given 0 0.7. But among these, which are not cannot be the probability of an event? Four results are given, which are not probability of an event. Now, you have to remember one thing is that. Uh, we know probability of an event is always lies between 0 and 1. We know this. That means the result in number line, this is 0, 1, 2, and this is minus 1. Answer always lies between 0 and 1. It cannot more than 1 or cannot be less than 0. So, answer always lies between this and this. This is the first thing. And also, we know one condition probability, suppose pi is greater than equal to 0. Probability always positive. It cannot be negative. That means we know this. And also, we know sum of the probabilities is always 1. So, the condition 1, each pi, each pi, that means for probability it cannot be negative, always positive. So, you have to remember this answer always lies between 0 and 1 and probability, each probability pi always positive. Now, we consider this problem, first one 2 by 3. This is no problem. 2 by 3 means 0. Uh, 666. This this lies in the interval. So this is correct. This will be probability. Next, you consider C. C given 15 percent. 15 percent means 15 by 100. That means 0. 0.15. This is okay. No problem. This result lies between this and this. This is 0. 0.7. 0. 0.7 also lies between 0 and 1. But minus 1.5 1.5 this year which is not possible outside of this range so this cannot be there are minus 1.5 cannot be the probability of an event therefore answer b minus 1.5 cannot be the probability probability of an event minus 1.5 cannot be the probability of an event so this is not possible because this one outside our range this one here minus 1.5 actually answer should be inside this so this your answer problem number 5 Problem number 5 is nothing. This one given probability of E is 0 0.05. What is the probability of not E? It is very interesting. So, this one given solution given given that probability of E equal to 0 0.05. Now, what is probability of not e we have to find not e equal to what but you know this formula what is the formula probability of e plus probability of not e this equal to 1 we know this formula so this is probability of not e 1 minus probability of e so, this 1 minus probability of E is 0 0.05 
and 0 0.05 if we subtract 1 minus this then this will be 0 0.95 therefore probability of not e equal to 0 0.95 and this is our answer very nice answer consider problem number 6 the problem is given a bag contains lemon flavored candies only. It has only lemon flavored candy. Malini takes out one candy without looking into the into bag. What is the probability that she takes out an orange flavored candy, a lemon flavored candy? So this is a problem. So it contains only lemon flavored. Suppose this is the bag. This is our bag. Oh, this is our bag. It is it contains lemon flavored. Lemon flavored candy in this bag. But uh, Malini Malini takes out one candy from this bag without looking. So this is big. Uh, just taking out uh, candy, one candy. Now we have to find what is the probability that she takes out an orange flavored candy. <laughs> it contains only lemon flavored orange candy which is not possible clear this one it has only lemon flavored candy but orange candy not possible answer is zero yes now a lemon flavored candy number two so solution is start number one we consider probability uh, getting and orange flavored candy equal to orange flavored candy is zero no or orange flavored candy so this zero by uh, this is total number not given so zero answer is zero so this is our answer and number two, a lemon flavored candy, it has only lemon flavored. So we get certain or sure even. Surely we get one lemon flavored candy because it has lemon flavored candy. So probability getting a lemon flavored candy equal to 1 this is certain even this is impossible even because it has only lemon flavored orange flavored not given so this result is 0 and this result is 1 this is our answer now we consider problem number 7 it is given that in a group of 3 students the probability of 2 students not having the same birthday is 0 0.992 what is the probability that the two students have the same birthday so number of student three and two students not having the same birthday is 0 0.992 now what is the probability that the two students have the same birthday very easy so we consider this solution so solution let e be the event that the two students 
having the same birthday. So, E be the event that the two students having the same birthday and uh, we consider this and given given that probability not E that means two students having not having the same birthday this given not E given not having the same birthday 0 0.992 we have to find probability of E, E equal to what? Having the same birthday, you have to find. Since we know this formula, probability of E plus probability of not E equal to 1. So, this implies probability of E equal to 1 minus probability of not E. So, this is 1 minus not E 0 0.992 and if we subtract this, this is 10, 10 minus 2, this is 8, 0, 0, 0, 0 0.008 and this is our answer. So, therefore, the required probability, the required probability probability that the two students that the two students have the same birthday equal to 0 0.008 not having same birthday is this and having same birthday is 0 0.008 so the required probability that the two students have the same birthday equal to 0 0.008 is our final answer the problem number 8 a bag contains three red balls, five black balls. A ball is drawn at random from the bag. What is the probability that the ball is ball drawn is red, not red? So we consider this is the bag. It has three red balls and five black balls. So we random means random number means you know all the results but we can't know uh, uh, we can't say advancedly which one will come so this is solution start here number of red ball number of red balls equal to 3 number of black balls equal to 5 total number of balls 3 plus 5 equal to 8 total number of balls 8 now one ball is drawn randomly from this bag. So what is the probability that the ball is red, not red? Number one, probability getting a red ball. So red ball, how many red balls we have? Three red balls. So three and total number is eight. So this is eight. 3 by 8 is our answer. Favorable by total outcomes. This is the probability. Next number 2. Not rate. Probability 
getting not getting not red ball not a red ball a red ball now not red ball means green uh, black balls black balls is five so this is five by eight not red ball means not a red ball not a red ball if the ball is not red then this must be black how many black balls five so this is five by eight so another formula we can use this is p e plus p e bar that means not e equal to one so p not e equal to one minus p e and p e red ball red ball is three by eight 8 is LCM 8 minus 3 this is 5 by 8 we can use this formula also or directly also if marks given 1 using direct formula if marks given 2 or 3 2 given then you can show in this way and this is our answer so there are students these are very interesting probabilities nothing in uh, class 10 probability these are very easy no one can say these probabilities is very difficult all of these are very easy so if you are feeling easy then please like this video if if you are new in my channel then please subscribe my channel and click the bell icon also thank you